Illustrator Mathematics came out of a uh, work I did nationally writing the Common Core State Standards in Mathematics. After that work was done, people wanted illustrations of the meaning of the standards. They wanted sample tasks that would, you know, like what does it look like for a kid to actually meet this standard in the classroom. We started out as a small project, well, not so small in the, in the end within the university that we thought we were doing good things and we thought it would come to an end. At some point, we realized that we were creating something bigger than just this resource, that we had a mission, um, that we really wanted to have an impact on the world, and TLA helped us like, get this project out of the university and into the world where it could have that impact. I've seen improvements in student scores using illustrative mathematics. I noticed the student scores aligned with what they were doing on the Arizona Merits, the standardized test that they take at the end of every year. And so that alignment was really nice because I could then see where students needed to grow. If students are minimally proficient on the state test, then they're scoring that minimally proficient score on illustrative mathematics test. And that's where I kind of really found it invaluable to teach with illustrative mathematics because I was able to see exactly where their deficiencies are, where I could improve on their scores. And I don't think mathematicians normally think of themselves as having inventions. It's not like a chemist or an engineer or something. But I thought, well, hang on, maybe this, this web resource that I've developed, maybe that's an invention. And so I went from there. So teaching illustrative mathematics in the future, uh, I'm super excited for. We just did a whole year as a pilot team. And so with this new curriculum launching, and we're going to be able to get our hands on the the finished product that I am, ha, Illustrated Mathematics has produced. I'm seeing myself in the future definitely using this resource. Illustrated Mathematics is an exemplar of, of a different type of technology that gets commercialized through technology transfer offices. There is no patent, which is kind of our normal coin of the realm in tech transfer offices. But this is a, a curriculum, an educational curriculum, which is not something that normally gets commercialized out of a university. And yet we're able to take this intellectual property and build a company, help build a company and support a company around it that's having real impact on the world. 